Hey everybody, I just got my local buffer USB in the mail. From I'll show you what it comes with. So it was 70 bucks, I think. Yeah, 70 bucks. Comes with a nice little package. There's the local buffer USB, comes with the cords you need to plug into your local net. And a user guide. 70 bucks US. And they give you a disc for Windows, Mac, which comes now with JMRI, so that's cool. So I'm going to get this hooked up and we'll see how it works. There's this everything it came with. 70 bucks from our circuits, that's what you get. So I got it going. It actually took me a while because my computer is a Mac Pro and it runs older 10.4 and uh, apparently they have some problems with it. So it took me about an hour and a half to get it going. Uh, I had to do, delete a couple files and add a couple as per some instructions from JMRI. But it's working good now. I got it hooked up to my DB150 and I've been programming and going on with it. It's pretty cool. I'm sure you guys have seen videos on YouTube, but the throttle is awesome. There's you know cool things you can do with it. It's just fun. There's lots of stuff. You know, it just adds and creates more things you can do with your railroad. So I'm happy with it. It wasn't that hard to hook up, and it's running on an old ancient Mac. I'm not going to show, uh, I'm not going to go too much into it, I'm sure you guys have seen lots of videos on what this program can do, but there's just lots of cool stuff, you can change basically everything, sound, horns, controls, speed tables, roster media, this is kind of cool, so if you saw the picture in the throttle that comes up in the background and then that's your icon, you can label all your functions, and uh, keep your info and notes and whatnot. But it's cool, I like it. I recommend the uh, local buffer USB by RR Circuits.